Well, today there was a hole in a foundation and it was near a rain gutter. And in our area, the rain gutter comes down. He didn't have a pipe away from it. It was going against the house in the winter it freezes and it busts the foundation apart. There was only a couple small holes, so we dug it out. We plastered it up, waited a couple days and tarred it. And then at the end, I'm gonna show you another little, little video of a different one. So here we go. And then we got over here, and he's wondering why you're getting water in the cellar. Well, he's got rain gutters, but the rain gutter comes down, and there's a big hole. And where's it going? In the cellar. So he's got to get a landscaper in here when we fix it and bank this all up. First thing, we're going to dig this out and see how bad it is down there. <laughs> so we know it goes right to there, I guess. Well, that's it. That's how we're going to fix. So we're digging down with the bar here. We're finding out this hole goes a little deeper. It goes deep as it goes. It's as deep as we got to go. Find out where it stops. It stops right there. So we're down in here. We keep hitting it until it's bad until we know it's good. Just like a dentist, like I always tell you, you just want to get rid of the bad stuff. So we'll wash that off. Take a look at it. So before we do anything else, mix our cement, gotta find out what's gonna fit here. That's gonna go first. Maybe we'll lay it flat like this. Go in there like this. That'll lay easier. Then we'll get the next one. Same thing, we gotta break it here. Put that in there like that. Chip some of this away more so we know it fits good. That's that. So this is in the way a little bit. Let's get that out of there like that. Here's the wire that goes through there. And that'll fit in there this way. Like this. See that? This gotta go. That'll go next. This is in the way. And that cement's hard. They use good cement. What's wrong is the blocks. And this will go like this. So we pretty much, maybe not, maybe we'll put this one in there. It's got to shorten up a little bit. Like that. Doesn't matter which way we put it, as long as it works. And this piece, we're going to make that fit a little bit better. Just like that. No big deal. So that's all going to go in there. It don't have to go in perfect. Just got to make sure that it fits. See? All right. It's all ready to go in. So now, I'm going to wash this all off in here. Once we wash that all off, it's clean and we know it's going to stick. So I've been using I've been using this a lot, fast set repair mortar, it's upside down, but I had a good luck with it. I would have brought rapid set, but I think this is good for what I'm using. I'm just going to mix this stuff up, get the sponge out a little water at a time, no big deal. Okay, that's about the way we want it. So let's look in the hole again. So we're in the hole. I'm just going to put some bricks in there, pieces of brick to keep that cement from falling down. Then I'm going to put it in there like that. You can plaster the sides a little bit, sometimes they help. And I'm going to put our first brick in here like this I did it. See that? And Plaster that up a little bit. We're gonna go again. Put 
There's a second brick in there. Keeping them tight because I remember it was tight. Squishing it down. All right. That's good. Now we're going to put our next brick in there. See the wire? There we go. Next brick is in there. See you how know, it's all coming together. You don't even have to use a trowel, you could use your hands. And this one goes. So last one. Let's put a little cement on it like this. And on top. It's gonna go in there like that. So that's basically it. Now, what I'm going to do, just so the cement sticks a little better, is I'm going to wet it. Those bricks were dry. You don't want to do it when it's when you're uh, laying them. So now we're just going to plaster it up. See that? Yeah, that? That wall is going to look like brand new. Shove it up in there a little bit to make sure she sticks. See that? You're working with fast drying cements. It's a uh, the miracle, miracle cement they call it. Then what you want to do is dig the old cement out here, and you can get a good look at what's going on on the bottom. Make sure we seal that up properly. Okay, that's it. Now we're gonna let that dry for a little bit. And as she uh, hardens up, we'll come back and sponge it. And see what we're doing, put enough on there. Like that. All right, it's kind of 20 minutes later. So it's getting pretty hard. I wanna smooth it out because I'm gonna come back and tar it. I'm gonna fill in all them holes, just like that, all the way down to the bottom. Then when we tar it, everything's gonna be even. So that's it. Just gonna wait a couple days and put some foundation coating in there. Okay, we got what they call a foundation coating here. And we're just going to paint it with the foundation coating. That's going to take, uh, keep the moisture from getting in there when he fills this all in. That's it, no big deal. It's all, all tarred up now. You can wait a day or two and fill the hole in. I did another little video where the camera went dead on me. I didn't get it, but you'll get the idea. It's the same thing. You just use the cement, the product, put it together, tar it up, and you're done. So I'll show you that. Now this is uh, another one that I did. It's a little bigger model, but the whole problem was the camera went dead before I could do it. So I only got the beginning and the, and the end. But all you do is you just dig it all out, you wash it all out, and you use your product, whether it's stone or brick. Put the cement on it and you're done. See, that's what it looks like when it's done and it's plastered up. And then they came and tarred it and that's the finish. And if you want to get into deeper repairs, they have masonry wall repair and foundation repair playlists. So check them out. So that's it for this video. You could check out my foundation repair videos and my mason repair videos. I have a lot of different playlists. Thanks for watching. I'm Mike Haddock. I'll see you next video.